What are the patterns in multiples of 10? Greg wants to train for a race. He will each swim, run, and bike 10 miles per week. The chart shows his training schedule. How many miles will Greg each swim, run, and bike to train for the race? The chart shows the number of weeks Greg will swim, run, and bike. For each activity, he will train at 10 miles per week. How many miles will Greg swim while training? You can use place value blocks to find multiples of 10. This block represents a group of 10. To find the number of miles Greg will swim in four weeks, find 4 times 10. 4 times 10 is 4 groups of 10, or 40. 40 is 10 times greater than 4. Greg will swim 40 miles. To find the number of miles Greg will run while training, find 10 times 10. 10 times 10 is 10 groups of 10, or 100. 100 is 10 times greater than 10. Greg will run 100 miles. Look at place value patterns in the multiples of 10. When you multiply a number by 10, the number tells you what to record in the tens place. The ones digit is always zero. The product increases by 10 each time. To find the number of miles Greg will bike while training, find 9 times 10. 9 times 10 is 9 groups of 10, or 90. Greg will bike 90 miles. Now you know the patterns in multiples of 10. Hey, Carlos. I hear you're planning on saving up for a skateboard. Let's work through a math problem using multiples of 10 to see how much you can save in 10 weeks. Sounds great! What is your allowance per week? It's only $5. Okay, let's work with that. Let's use place value blocks to model the problem. 5 times 10 is 5 groups of 10, or 50. Correct. At this rate, after 10 weeks, you will have enough to buy a $50 skateboard. What do you think? Hmm, I don't think so. Maybe I can convince my parents to increase my allowance to $8 a week. Right. Let's use place value patterns and see what that will get you. What are place value patterns? It's actually quite easy. We know that 1 times 10 is 10, and we know that 5 times 10 is 50. See the pattern? If your allowance is $6 a week, how much would you earn after 10 weeks? Yes, I see the pattern. I'd get $60. And with an allowance of $7 a week, you can save $70 in 10 weeks. If you can convince your parents to increase your allowance to $8 a week, then how much would you have for your skateboard? $80? That might be just enough to get the one I want. Thanks. Good luck convincing your parents.